humans are masters of deception. You know why scientists say humans evolved intelligence? What do you think's the reason? Why do humans have vocal cords and no other animal does really? Or at least not elaborate vocal cords. What's a scientific theory of vocal cords? Vacation? Oh, communicate. Yeah, communication. But like a more specific. There was pressure in the past. They call it pressure. And all of a sudden, a certain type of people who could, for example, at the beginning, like Neanderthals couldn't talk that well and humans could. And so they could, they, we hunt, our ancestors hunted down our cousins and killed them all. They also mated with them. So Homo sapien men 100,000 years ago, I forget when Neanderthals disappeared, but we're, everybody in this room is like 3%. Two to three percent Neanderthal, which means your ancestors both slept with the women or the men and killed them because there's no Neanderthals left. So that was the first one evolution was for violence. So like, let's say me, you, us four guys here, let's say there's a huge Neanderthals were bigger and stronger, but they couldn't talk well. They were like cavemen. They'd be like, Ugh. and there's like two dudes and like, Ugh. and but the four of us, we could be like, hey, wait till it's dark. Used to sneak around the back. We'll come distract him in the front, and when he's looking at us, hit him in the back of the head with a rock. They found like Neanderthal skulls, and most of them have violent human. They'll have like a an arrow or a, or a heavy rock. You can see they were killed. So one is violence. What's another reason humans have the ability to talk? Passion. So if you go to a restaurant, I'm gonna I'm gonna ruin the rest of your all's lives at restaurant right now. Seventy percent of all restaurant and human talk is gossip. So next time you go to a restaurant, if you don't believe me, start listening to what tables around you are talking about. Now, not little kids, but adults. I, 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 first time I read this, I was in London. This was like in August. I read this and I was like 70%. So I went to this restaurant in London. I'm sitting there and there was a two attorneys it was crazy. I could, I heard the whole case of a murder case. It was one it was a woman talking to another woman attorney, and she's like, "Yeah, we shouldn't have lost." I mean, she had no filter. I was thinking, she I, I don't know if she could see me. It was a restaurant, and she was like, "Yeah, it's like they withheld evidence. He killed us." And I was thinking, gossip. So one of the leading theories of why humans have vocal cords is so women could gossip about men because men were too physically strong. Now, women are afraid of men now. How would you have felt 100,000 years ago where there's zero police? There's zero law. So the only thing you had was your brothers. Brothers and male relatives used to kill other men. But if you found yourself in a village where your brothers weren't, how did women survive? Guess what women did? They gossiped. So they, now men, has your experience ever been that women have ganged up on you verbally? Like you're dating a girl and she tells her friend and then also in the gang comes around and all of a sudden you're getting pressure like you're not that nice to my girlfriend because 10 women gossiping. Now, men, women, how many men have had their dude friends talk to you? Guys don't ever gossip that much. Guys can be going, they don't talk. So one of the dominant theories and some people, no way to know if it's true is that Vocal cords were response to violence by men and women who could speak better survived. And so they passed on better vocal cords over thousands of generations. And now Homo sapiens have very elaborate conversation. And if you think that's not true, like I said, if you look at the observation, even in modern humans, it's 70% gossip. That's what people talk about. Go listen anytime you're in a restaurant. Listen to what people are talking about. Listen to like the four tables around you. Somewhere, somebody, somebody's going, Becky at work, you know, I'm just like a little concerned about my boss. And I, it's crazy. Now, I'm switching. That was a precursor to my first question. Why are humans intelligent? It's very similar to vocal cords. One of the dominant theories, by, by me, probably the most respected scientist on earth. This is his theory. 